Hello, today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa, I'm a crude free YouTuber and today, once again, I'm back with a good red with me and I was like debating on if I should do this video as I like, that is the only thing I'm doing right now but uh, yeah, I don't know where this is going to go so I think we just get started and I'm going to do a get ready with me. I think it's going to be kind of short. I hope. I don't know. Um, i sorry in advance because I don't know where this is going. I'm going to use my secret palette from Nabla. I'm going to do a super easy look. Um, and just do a look with this. And yeah. I think we just get started. So... <coughs> Maybe you can hear my voice that I do not sound like myself if you even remember how I used to sound. I've been having a really bad cough. I've been coughing. Um, for about a week it's so much better now. It's not much at all anymore. But my throat is a little bit uh, because of it and uh, I guess that is not so strange. But I, I don't know if I have been sick or if I have been allergic to anything. I think I have been sick. But like that cough has been the only thing. I haven't felt sick. I haven't been, like my sore hasn't, been, my sore, my throat hasn't been sore or anything. So I don't know. But I guess I have been sick, but um, nothing like bad. I have, um, everything has been as it should, except that. I have a little bit of trouble sleeping, that's all. And okay, what I want to talk about in this video that I haven't talked about like 500 times before, I don't know. It feels like I'm just repeating myself. Do you hear the fucking seagulls? If you haven't been here before, like seagulls is an animal that I hate. I want them to be extinct. Um, I hate them so much and that is one of the few things I don't like living by the ocean is this fucking seagulls all the time so the thing I wanted to talk about yet again I first off I want to thank you so much for my for my for the support I got on my latest video I talked about things that I've learned being on YouTube for very many years and uh, you were so nice to me and I haven't answered all the comments yet I'm so sorry about that it has been like three weeks um, but I just want to thank you and like I don't deserve you right now it feels like you are so sweet to me and I'm just I don't know you know that really bad friend you have that is me right now. So, if, if what is going on in my life? Not much. <laughs> I'm working a lot now again. And my boss has vacation, so it's going to be a lot of work for four more weeks. And it is vacation time in Sweden. So, yeah, it's going to be a lot of work this summer. As it always is, I am not going on vacation until August. I don't know why. Always in the beginning of the year when I like going to... How do you say that in English? Like plan your vacation. I'm always like I'm taking it in August. So the weather is almost good in all August and like the big vacation thing is over in Sweden so I missed always yeah August it will be fine and then June is arriving and I'm like I have to wait two more months I don't know why I do this but it's always good to have vacation in August I think maybe not now but I know that in August I'm going to feel like it was a great idea and that is the only thing I'm trying to think about now when I'm just a little bit tired of 
still have to go to work for like two more months but yeah what are you gonna do and i've been trying to like remember what i've talked about in my latest videos um about my channels channels my channel my feelings about it and i don't want to repeat myself but i think i'm going to and i just feel like i am in a confused part in my life right now i don't know what is going on i it feels like i'm having a midlife crisis like i haven't been feeling bad about getting older but right now i do not know who i want to be and who i am and yeah I, ju I i just don't know i don't know what to do with my hair like i My hair is a big problem for me. I don't know why. I don't know what I want to do with it. I'm like never happy with it. But at the same time, it's not uh, not often that I do anything with it. Um, I did cut bangs like a year ago. And I do still like my bangs, I think. Um, yeah, but more than that, I don't know. And now this length of my hair i just hate it i think it looks awkward it doesn't look good like it's not long but it's not short and it's just yeah i don't know i don't like it and i don't know should i save it out or should i cut it short like this short i had this short in october and now it's this length so i think my hair is growing kind of fast and now I I just have my hair up in a ponytail like always and forever and my hair you know when you have a high ponytail for a long time or a ponytail just it's it's hurting your hair or your scalp and that is happening with me and I do not want that so I don't know what to do because now I just like always having my hair up which I hate but at the same time I don't like this and I haven't done my shade my little undercuts for a couple of weeks I usually like save, shave it once a week and I don't know what to do about them I don't know anything <laughs> and I am just yeah, I guess I'm having a midlife crisis. I don't know what to wear um, for kind of clothes. I don't know anything. And with my YouTube channel right now, I don't know if it's strange to talk about this or not, but a part of me is like, maybe I should quit. Like, maybe I should not do this anymore. But it. <laughs> I just I don't want to do a video and say I'm like yeah I'm quitting YouTube and then I might feel better like in two weeks in six months I don't know maybe I feel like oh I want to come back and then it is so strange to say like I have quit YouTube and then I haven't but at the same time I <clears throat> as you know if you have been following me for a while I have been struggling for a couple of years with stress and everything in the end of 2020 I was re I had COVID and I was really sick for like two weeks and then it was going on for a couple of months I was really really tired and then 2021 my dad was really really sick and then 2022 I did work so so much and I don't know if I really have recovered from that and yeah I'm just not in a like a super good place now I think someone is having a party I'm so sorry but I have to have the windows open because it's hot in here 
and uh, yeah, it hasn't felt like I have been in a super good place in my life and I'm still not and yeah as you have noticed this year I haven't posted much and I think it have made me feel better but at the same time I am I guess that some of you do the same as me. Okay, do you know what? I'm going to... Do we have any fallouts? Yeah, maybe a little. I'm just going to take away the fallouts. I get it. Okay, I'm going in with... A shimmer, just a little bit. Um, it feels like I was talking about something super serious and then I was like, I'm going to take away the fallouts and now I don't know what, to talk, what I was going to talk about. Oh yeah, um, I guess that some of you have the same feelings as I have when I'm going to say this. You know when you have been very stressed or you have not been in a good place mentally. And you're like, okay, I have to take a chill. Like I have to relax as much as I can when I'm off and I have to... Okay, do you know what? My battery's dying, so... I'm just going to change it. And this wasn't fully charged either. Um, okay, you know when you have been stressed for a while and not been in like a super good mental health and you know that you need to relax but then every time you try to relax you feel bad for not doing anything. Like you're scrolling on Instagram, you're scrolling on TikTok you're watching YouTube videos, you're watching TV shows, being on Netflix like the whole weekend. And not like leaving your apartment <laughs> like at all uh, when you're off work or when you are yeah, just home. And you feel a little bit bad about it and deep down you know that you shouldn't feel bad about it because it's just what you need. I am in that place. I know that I need to chill. I know that I need to just do nothing but I have a hard time doing nothing but at the same time not. Or maybe I should, should say I don't have a hard time doing nothing but I have a hard time not feeling bad about doing nothing. But yeah okay I'm going to use this one. This is a skin tint from body shop that I bought a couple of weeks back so if anybody of you feel the same way that you have you know that you have to do nothing but you feel bad about it that is okay and you shouldn't feel bad about it okay this product I just don't know I don't know if I should apply it with my hands or with a brush I'm not a super fan of that, but it feels like my sponge is sucking up all the product and dress it a little bit. Yeah. And I don't know, even like, is this too dark for me? Is this the lightest shade? This is light 1N. Or one of the lightest shades. They have different undertones, but I am a neutral undertone, so I did go with this. But I don't know, like, is this a little bit too, too dark for me? Isn't it too dark? Or is it too yellow? I don't know. But I have this um, fresh nude from the body shop um, that I have in fair 1N. So, yeah, I don't know. So, yeah, that is what I've been up to. Not doing shit. But at the same time, I have done a lot more things than I usually do especially on weekends so yeah I think we can like establish that this skin tint is a little bit too dark or I don't know it's so hard to see in the viewfinder and now when I have the studio lights I think it's also a little bit hard to see but it's not like covering almost anything and that is what I want and now I'm just feeling pissed off I shouldn't I should know myself that I shouldn't 
record when I am like this, but yeah. In one way it feels like I owe something, but in another way I know. One part of me is like, it feels like I owe you an explanation. I, it feels like I owe you to tell you where I at, where I am and why I'm not posting, but at the same time I know that I do not and I have never felt that and I have been thinking like if I should do more like reels or something and maybe just have a break from YouTube and maybe post shorts or something but then I'm like with what should I still do makeup I have no idea and then that I'm like maybe I should stop doing YouTube and maybe do like reels or start a TikTok or something, but at the same time, maybe I don't want to. I don't know. And uh, about what should I do TikToks with makeup, or as I have <laughs> wanted and thinking about for quite some time is to do like I don't know what suits best I don't think YouTube but I don't know um trying to find my style like my style journey as a 30 year old something mid size or whatever size I am I don't know um trying to find my style because right now I am confused and I'm trying <laughs> really hard like to understand what I want to address in what I want to yeah how I want to look and I have no idea I think I've never been more confused than I am right now and I'm testing things in my closet that I haven't used for ever and maybe only used once um, but like I don't know if I'm confident enough to do it and I don't know if I'm in a headspace where I can start something new um, I don't know and it's just I'm I'm just feeling as I don't know I don't know what I want to do I don't know anything so I guess this is like maybe the if you look up midlife crisis maybe this is a picture of me in the state like oh yeah that is midlife crisis but yeah I don't know and at the same time like with my youtube channel I do love the little community I have here I do love all of you and I'm going to miss it if I'm not going to do YouTube or yeah I'm going to miss it and I just don't know so I'm guessing we are coming nowhere yet again with me posting a video I'm getting more confused and you are getting more confused and yeah, I just don't know and maybe I should like I am always a little bit confused but I don't think that I usually is this confused. Not when it comes to my YouTube channel. I have not since I started my channel been this confused about it. And okay, I am going to do my brows off cam and I'm going to see what I'm going to take for lipstick because yeah, I don't know if I said it but my lip cracked here this morning because I have been <clears throat> yeah apparently being sick or what whatever this has been um so my lips were so dry this morning I didn't I uh, usually I'm really good to using like a lip mask when I'm sleeping but yesterday I was so tired so I was like fuck it and uh, yeah then it cracked and okay I am <sighs> going to fix my brows off cam Maybe I'm going to take this lip oil from NYX. Uh, 
on my lips and put on mascara. So I will fix that and then I come back. So the look is done and I did take this olive oil from NYX. It's their fat oil, lip trip, lip trip fat oil maybe in that chic and I do like it. Maybe it's a little bit like too sticky for my liking. I'm not a lip gloss kind of girl. Maybe more now, <laughs> more than ever, but uh, it's not my super favorite. So yeah, I guess that was all for this video. I do really hope that you liked it. And I, the thing is like with this, when I think I'm like, should I just quit YouTube? The thing I don't want to, or why I don't, why I haven't, and why I, a part of me doesn't want to, because I do have videos that I do look forward to like record, but that I haven't, but at the same time, it's taking me so, so long. Like today, I have been sitting here at my makeup table for a really long time before I pressed record and I don't know if it is because it is a little bit messy in here I don't know if you can see things on the bed and yeah um I don't know if that is like why I don't want to I have cleaned and I have decluttering and redone how I have my makeup um but yeah like for example I did a decluttering on my lipsticks a month ago or more I still have all the lipsticks here because in Sweden you have to throw them away you can't throw them in the normal trash you have to throw them away yeah and that is like <sighs> I'm not a clean person like perfectionist and have it clean in the apartment at all time but I do love to have it clean but I am not like good at having it clean and I don't know if that is putting me off but yeah I want to like do a video and talk about <clears throat> more about my Nova and how I think it has changed me because I'm still like on some sort of a Nova or really really like a low buy or I'm just like a normal person and not a YouTube person anymore when it comes to buying makeup and I think I need to sneeze and I still want to talk about like makeup more and I still want to find like what I like in makeup now um, compared to what I did like a couple of months back or a year back and I, I still like I want to do these videos I know that like I feel like I want to do them but I don't know when I don't know how I don't know How, when, <laughs> where, and that I don't know, and uh, I guess it will take a couple of weeks more before I post the video again. I'm just guessing, <laughs> because, it, 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 but but with me, like you never know, and yeah, maybe that's all I want to say with this video. But I hope that you like this video and to calm you down and maybe also myself I'm this is not my last video I'm not going to quit now I just I don't know I honestly don't know and uh, yeah <laughs> where to go from this I am think I'm just going to end the video here um if you want to on my Instagram which I'm not posting on as well I have started to post my mails should I go into this just a little bit quick just to have something more happy to talk about I don't know if you have noticed but I often do have like things on my nails now I have these nails because I was uh, at the graduation this week, My one of my brother's little sisters, and I thought these were like, yeah, okay, whatever. Um, I have been liking to do my nails since I was 
10 maybe and this year I was like I'm going to fix them once a week. I've almost done it every week this year and I've started to post them on my Instagram and taking nail picks it's really hard I, I haven't got the hang of it yet I'm still trying out new things but I've started to post them and I've saved them in highlight in my uh, on my page and yeah I guess that maybe was all so if you want to see a little bit of nail content go to my Instagram and yeah I think I'm just going to end the video here I hope that you liked this I hope that I'll see you soon and uh, we will see when I'm me again and where I will be here Instagram TikTok I have no idea but yeah I hope that you liked this video and I hope that I will see you somewhere bye